Okay, hello everybody, and welcome back to Mass Effect Andromeda, where I was recording for like literally a minute before I realized that the mic, I had the wrong mic input selected. So, but it was funny, you guys missed that guy, he like glitched over to here, like, like just slid over, like I was over there, and then the game is still trying to load in, and I like turned around really fast, hey god, did you see what he did? Is that gonna happen like frequently, or what? Go back over there. That was funny. So what I was saying is that despite us having a couple of things that I, I, I want to get that done for sure, and these of course and all that, um, I feel like some of the reason that I'm a little bit on edge or uneasy or something whenever I play this game is that I really just want to know how it's going to end. I mean, the game's been out for like eons now, and I'm sure everybody's finished it like ten times, but like, I still haven't finished it. <laughs> And, uh, I think, as usually I like to finish everything else before I finish the main game plot. But I think in this instance it might actually help if I know kind of how the main plot's gonna end, and then I can just carry on doing other things that I want to do. Because I'd love to do all the quests in this game, but I feel always kind of on edge, like I have more important things to be doing. And I feel like the proper way to play this... Like, if you were the Pathfinder, what you would actually do is you would legitimately pound out the main, like, figuring out Meridian and stuff. And then you'd go back and do all the Pathfindery things. So, so I think that's what I'm going to do at this point. And hope it doesn't glitch anything up. And I really hope, now that I think about it, that I uploaded the correct, or I uploaded the video... And that I'm not, I haven't been, like, not uploading for days because I actually have one in reserve without realizing it. <laughs> I have to double check now. I'm also feeling slightly under the weather, so you might be able to tell. Um, there is a highly infectious respiratory infection going around my house right now. And I'm just kind of hoping. Apparently it affects kids worse than adults. So we'll see. <laughs> we'll see if I die. Hello again. Hey, what's up? They're waiting for you. Careful. Ryder made a sentimental choice saving those Krogan. She looked at them and thought of you. Ryder's uh... her own person. Just admit you don't like her. Oh, no! <clears throat> the Pathfinder. He's gonna be Ryder, mad. We were just discussing your encounter with the Archon. There was no time to save both. I had to make a decision. Such is the burden of leadership. Nevertheless, it is good to see Ark Parchero reunited with the Nexus. Yet I have to question what we gained, provoking the Archon like this. Oh man, I'm sitting here like I have popcorn. showing the location of Meridian. Now we have it, and a short window to get there. It's the control center for the terraforming network. If we get that working, all our problems are solved. Based on what data? This is all alien science. The vault on Aya suggests that Meridian is the key. While I appreciate what you've done for our strike team, <laughs> we're not equipped for a war with the Cat. They'll be defending Meridian with everything they've got. If we do nothing, I guarantee there's a fight coming. The Archon's already studying how to exalt us. It's not pretty. Still, it's better to focus on the outposts. If the Cat attack, at least our people won't be in one place. Then there's this Sam of yours. We took a chance letting AI. Oh, involved. you're gonna get mad at me too? Frankly, I'm uncomfortable with just how involved it's become. Okay, really? I like you, Ryder. I really do. But I can't support your plan. Really? Then I will. Woo! And so will I. The Pathfinders! I agree. Ryder deserves a chance to try. I applaud the gesture, but you answer to me. I hope you understand. Uh, I hope that didn't mess it up. I'm really mad that it glitched. It kind of, my computer does that sometimes when I turn it on. It just decides to act, to black out, and it makes me really mad. But wow, I wonder what would have happened if I hadn't saved all the Pathfinders before this, you know? What's the matter, Tan? Don't want anyone else overshadowing you? It's not called the Pathfinder Initiative. The chain of command has to be respected. That is all. We don't answer to him. Why am I surprised? I don't exactly have a plan B. There may be a way. Pathfinder, 
Apologies. There was an urgent message for you. <gasps> they said your brother is awake. What? <laughs> Go. We'll talk later. In the tech lab. Yes, yes, yes. He's awake. My brother's awake. You're finally awake, you Nico Poop. Oh, I need your help, my brother. I need your help. Scott. Scott! There you are. Touchy feely time. Touchy feely time! Don't you think you slept in long enough? I thought it was Saturday, then Sunday. But then I figured someone turned the alarm off. <laughs> well, I sure missed having you around. We've hit a few rough patches along the way. I'm sorry I wasn't there when Dad died. No one could have saved him, Scott. I wasn't even sure I should tell you. I'm glad you did. That would have been a hell All right. of a thing to wake up yes. to. Yes. I'll miss him. But right about now, he'd be telling us to stop moaning and get on with it. There's no shortage of things to do. Yeah, I hear you're the great and honorable Madam Pat. <laughs> Please, it's nothing like that. As soon as I get my gear, well. Careful. Are you alright? No way are you fit for duty, sir. You need a chance to mend. Yeah, says who? I know you don't like being reminded you're my little brother. Little brother! <laughs> so relax and let your sister take care of things. Hmm. If you say so. More sleep for me. You can keep talking if you'd like. Just no arm wrestling. I'll do my best. That, I think Ryder, that's a joke they included. Ricks. We have some ideas about Meridian. Come by the tech lab as soon as possible. Pathfinders we'll are going to get stuff done. Um. No, but, um. They, uh, Frida, um, Wolf Wolfson, I think, and Tom Taylorson are the voice actor and actress, respectively, for the Pathfinders. And, um, they had, like, a joke thing. Because she's a very, very strong personality, the actual voice actress for Ryder. And, like,. Tom Taylorson seems like a much more laid back dude and it was just really funny. They had like a video where like she was like, I'm the older one. I I'm the older one. And it was just I'm glad they threw that in there. Oh man. My controller's like all skewy. Broken. Not broken, just wearing out. You bet your hey. baloney we're gonna You feel chat. out of the loop, I imagine? A little. Though I've heard bits and pieces of things from Harry and the med techs. Sounds pretty serious. Just the fate of the entire initiative. Every man, woman, child, and everything in between facing certain extinction. The usual. Oh. Well, I'm sure the Pathfinder manual covers that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We'll have it wrapped by lunch. There's a race of aliens called the Cat. They're led by a scary nutjob named Archon who wants to turn all of us into them. We both want Meridian, which is the heart of an alien terraforming network. I love to this activate. summary. Do that, maybe we live. Look at my big sister being all proactive. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm mastering the art of peeing in a plastic jar. <laughs> oh my gosh. Feeling homesick at all? Still trying to get my sea legs, but I think about what might have been if everything hadn't gotten screwed up. What do you think would be different? Well, while you were looking for Prothean artifacts, I was standing watch over a Mass Effect relay. Hell of a thing to stare at every day. I dream about what was on the other side. Yeah. The adventures I would have. Her, her backstory is way better in my mind. But when everything got screwed up, well, I guess I'll never know. Oh, screwed up like with dad. Okay. Screwed up how? We'll start with mom dying. I never cried so hard. And Dad? He was never the same after that. He put so much into Sam to save her, but... Well, AI's as illegal as it gets in the Milky Way. After the Alliance kicked him out for it, everything changed. Suddenly, being Alec Ryder's kid was a black mark. You and I were never going to live that down. It's true. I thought maybe we could talk about Mom and Dad. Sure. What about them? You still think about mom? Yeah. Especially now. I wonder what she'd say if she could see us. Dad talked about her before we went on our first mission. Really? 
After she died, Dad seemed to shut down. He hadn't talked about her in years. He loved her. I think he was just lost. We all were. Yeah, that's the thing. What do you remember about how they met? Well, she was in the Alliance researching early biotic implants. That's about the time she met Dad. He was on Earth for N7 training, I think. He says he swooped in and swept her off her feet. Had a whole bad boy in uniform vibe <laughs> that was irresistible. Dad? I guess it worked. They got married. Then the first contact war started, and he was sent off to fight. After that, we were born. And Dad was posted to the Citadel as an attaché. So he didn't, did he get to do work as N7 for very long? What do you remember about growing up on the Citadel? Big space station chock full of all sorts of aliens. Scary at first, but pretty soon I was playing laser tag with Turian and Solarian kids. Looking back on it, maybe that's why I'm here. The Citadel showed me life has no limit on possibilities. It made me ask, what else is out there? I think, uh, I mean, that makes sense, right? Like, you you're, you see, like, the world at your fingertips, sort of, on the Citadel. All kinds of things available. And it's like, well, what else could there be? Like, once you have the whole world, the whole galaxy at your fingertips, it's like, what else is there, you know? What do you remember about Mom's biotic research? What do you research? remember? What do you remember? Mostly what do you remember? the thing that finally killed her. Biotics weren't unknown back then. So were the dangers. All sorts of rare diseases hit people working around Ezo. Mom was trying to design implants to help people harness their abilities. She was a pioneer. And she actually gave it to him. Thought you might want to know how Dad died. I was going to ask you. Habitat 7. There was this alien terraforming machine that had us stranded. Dad figured it out and shut it down. That saved us our ass. Then, all oh, hell broke loose. My helmet got smashed. I couldn't breathe. I was suffocating. Then, Dad gave me his helmet. He sacrificed himself? I never really knew with Dad. He could be so distant. I guess he loved us more than we knew. When it mattered most. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, oh. You should also know. Dad was keeping some secrets from us. Like what? Turns out Sam is even smarter than anyone knew. And Dad juiced his connection to Sam. It's a lot more powerful than other Pathfinders. So is mine. I guess rank has its privileges. What was Dad up to? Dad encrypted some of his memories in Sam. I've started unlocking them. What were they? You and I were there. So was Mom. You actually saw her? That reunion dinner she wanted us at so badly. Right. Dad was his usual talkative self. But there was something else. I saw Dad talk with a benefactor in the Milky Way. Some initiative bigwig I'd never heard of. That's news to me. Yeah. I'm still hoping I can figure out what also, it all means. Also, there was murder! Well, I'll let you take it easy then. Yeah, you wouldn't believe how slammed I am. Got a nap, then doze a bit, then try to catch up on sleep. It'll get better. Not before you find that meridian. I want in. I want in. I'll take pictures. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> He's awesome. I love him. This is not good. Yeah, love him. It'd be so cool if, like, at the end he could, like, join your squad. It'd be really cool. It'll be weird to play this someday on the other side with having her in the... Cold seat. <laughs> After a high profile exile, Krogan are returning to the Nexus. The yes. Krogan have been welcomed back into the initiative after officials accepted their push for equal status. Freak yeah! Welcome to the support and resources. New Tachunka will now receive. It's freaking it's about time. About this time. Is HNS. It's about time. So going with her away seemed to go seemed to be okay. Where am I going? The... Yeah, upstairs, upstairs. I'm going upstairs. Our skin tones seem kind of different. I don't know if it was the cutscene or what, but his seemed to have that... I don't know. It was a little different.
Ryder, good to see you. We've been working with Dr. Aradana and her team on the problem of getting to Meridian. Can't stop we the Pathfinder. We the answer. I'm listening. It's plans for new technology we've designated Ghost Storm. Hmm. As you approach Meridian, our own ships can broadcast fake returns for the Tempest. The Ket won't know which one is real. Whoa. It will confuse their sensors and draw their ships off. It could buy you some time. I can work with that. Just enough to give us an advantage. The rest is up to you. I can handle it, though it means going against the initiative. We're alone here. You didn't hear that. <laughs> hear what? We've been collating gamma charts all day. <laughs> Everyone else looks so official in their armor, and I'm like, what's up in my radioactive tank top? The risk comes with the job. Part of being a Pathfinder. <laughs> sure, if they'd pay us once in a while. Not after this. <laughs> You'll need to research the ghost stuff. I love her armor! First, then we'll meet you at Meridian. Oh, of Good course luck. I'll have to research it. Of course I have to research it, don't I? But my the plants have adapted to the Scourge's presence. Some even feed on its radiant energy. See this older specimen? The growth ring showed the Scourge's beginnings. The Pathfinder scanner captured it perfectly. Hmm? Oh, yes. Properly steamed or roasted, naturally. We won't starve yet. Okie dokie. Someday I'll get to all those, uh, I'll get to all you guys'... Is... Wait. Is this the way out? Not the way out. Where's the way out? How do I leave? Okay. So we have to integrate it into our system. That's, that's what I saw on the little checklist thing. Of course, I only have vanilla Coke with me. I don't have water, so my throat is like gonna kill me. Why? That's why you came here in the first place. I love that red foil. It's so pretty. Carrie's producer. I got him. <laughs> Saw something about the Natanis there. That was the Asari. No. Yes. That wasn't. Was it the Turian? I don't remember. I don't remember all their names. Chat. Yeah, we can definitely chat. Ah, there you are. Yeah. I was wondering, when you found the Solarian Ark, was anything strange, out of place? You mean besides the exalted Krogan, the relics, and getting jabbed in the neck? Why are you asking? Because a few hours ago, we received this. Hello, Ryder. I don't think the Solarian Ark was captured by chance. If you want to know more, meet me at these coordinates. That's all. Do you think it's some sort of hoax? Now that I think about it, a Ket Armada just stumbling across the Solarian Ark seems a little convenient. Coincidences do happen, though when you put it like that. I'll put the coordinates for this meeting in the nav computer. I suppose there's no harm in making sure. Mm. Mm -hmm. Is that something we should check out before we uh, go to Meridian? Huh. Follow the leads to uncover the truth. No, thank you. No, thank you. All right, let's just let's just do this. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. I'm sure I do. I'm sure it is outstanding. All right, guys, get ready. To buckle up. The Ghost Storm technology has been fully oh researched, gosh, Pathfinder. Oh my really? Excellent. We're ready to make our push on Meridian then. I'll call a meeting immediately. This meeting room? I'm a little concerned. I'm a little worried. Bitcoin channels already, Pathfinder. Oh, buddy. This is exciting! This is what I want to do. I can't find my water cup. Discuss the map. 
The Nexus leaders think our search for Meridian is a waste of time, but we know they're wrong. Turning on vaults won't be enough without the heart of the system. No, not me. We. We are going to defy Wait, them. did I miss Aha, something? That's the spirit. And the kit? That's where the ghost storm technology comes I in. I did. There was definitely a line Isn't that's that missing right, there. Hater? Exactly. Our forged signals should divert some cat from you. It won't be all of them, but it'll be enough. The tempest is small and fast. I don't need a big window. We'll drop you off and make our exit before the cat catch on. Once we're on Meridian, it'll be a small team. Move fast, figure out its secrets. Right behind enemy lines. Good time to assess their numbers, defenses. And when you're ready, we'll extract you the same way we got you in. If we come back with actuals on Meridian, the Nexus will sit up. Sounds like a solid plan, team. Hager, you ready? Good to go on your word, Pathfinder. All right, guys, this is it. Let's get moving. Woo! Arriving Jal and Drek. Go to the key to Shira in the Civic Civic Civicki system. Civicki. 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 Oh. Maybe bone up on the uniform protocol, Liam. Subsection shirts. Civilian ship. What will they do? Dock my pay? <laughs> we get paid. <laughs> Why? You buy it next time we go to Kadara? Are you kidding? You should see my tab. <laughs> Subsection shirts. Liam doesn't need to wear a shirt. It's fine. I don't mind. It is technically a civilian ship. I do keep forgetting that. Alright, peace out, Nexus. Here in the scourge, way in the scourge. Jeez. I would think if there was something. I'm like, eh, should I go to Kadar Port? But I'd be like, hey, lover, off I go. Probably not. I think it would have told me. I always get excited when I see the, the zoom in, you know? If the Archon's information is right, this is the system. Meridian should be here somewhere. Here On approach. we Trajectory looks good. go. I do miss in one of the Mass Effect trilogies, or multiples, I can't remember. Um. Being able to hover over a system and see which quests I had there, because otherwise, to find all the memories, I'm gonna have to like go to each system and check That's the it. planets. That's Meridian. Oh hey. Or key to Sira, as the Keth call it. Looks like a giant space station. It's super infected. What have I done? Do I have done something? Why won't it let me, like... Oh, okay, I don't have- Okay, I thought I had to, like... I thought I had to, like, hover over it. I was like, what? Should be fine, should be fine. Yes, indeed, should be fine. Jaw and Drag. We need to bring Jaw because I want to hear his opinions on all this. He's the local. Reminds me of Mass Effect 2 a little bit. Initiating Ghost Storm on my mark. Three, two, go. Woo! 
Stealthy, stealthy, stealthy. Hager, it's working. Reading a bunch of cat headed our way, pulling back. It's all on you now, Tempest. We should get them as close as possible to here. Intense readings could be some kind of control center. No decent landing sites. This could get messy. How Drop messy? Us. Ryder, looks like a flyby is our only option. Yes! We'll get as low as possible, but you'll have to eject over the target area. <laughs> okay. I've fallen out of so many things now, I should be a pro. Heard about your free fall to Habitat 7. Liam ha! said he could hear you screaming the whole way down. Don't let it Keep the button this go around, huh? It's embarrassing. <laughs> All right, you know the drill. Watch your rate of descent. Shield should take care of the rest. So far, so good. The cat haven't detected us. But once we go in, we'll be clear as day to any troops on the ground. Don't worry about us. Just make sure you and the Tempest get out safe. Loud and clear. Oh man, I'm so excited! Look at my beautiful ship. Rolls. That was really graceful, you guys. I look so bad, eh? <laughs> Is it like raining? Everyone okay? Fine, don't answer. We'll need to survey the area, figure out what we're dealing with. Oops. I am detecting active conduits nearby. Your scanner should be picking them up. It's raining? How is it raining? I like it. Keeps things cool. That's a bit odd, yeah. Pathfinder, while interacting with that console, I detected the presence of a complex network connected via a central command hub. A hub? You mean we found Meridian's controls? Most likely. However, the hub is dark, deactivated. Okay, good. Glowy, 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 glowy. Yes. It vibrated at me. Let's see what Meridian's all about. We can start by finding its central hub. I just realized this is probably gonna be a hellish experience. Made up of um a bunch of basically vault puzzles. I'm not excited. Pathfinder, whoa. we are looking at the central command hub. Oh, I oh, okay, whoa. As with the monoliths and vaults, the hub is connected to the two neighboring towers. Please, dear heaven, no. Please, no. So activating the towers no. will also activate the command hub. Oh, we're all plan. wet. I say we activate Meridian. Now, Cat won't like that. Activating a vault has previously activated a purification field. Perhaps Meridian is similar. Let's head to those towers and see what we can find. Pathfinder, interfacing with that console has activated a gravity well. I can't jump off. I can't Kamehameha. That's not a Kamehameha, Kamehameha, but you know what I mean. I can't jump off. Pathfinder, I'm picking up radio interference, a cat signal. Alert! The detected signal was a decoy. Key to zero has been infiltrated. All units are to focus on incapacitation and capture of the Pathfinder. Ooh, not, not killing me. they're getting you. Drag, I'm gonna cry, thank you. They're supposed to incapacitate. I thought the Archon wanted me dead. I saw 
possibly. What? Oh god. How'd you get up there? I need to check out those other two towers first. What? Yay. Okay, so the cat. Oh, is this is this a cat ship that got infected by the scourge? Oh, okay, there we go. Sam, what do you think? Intense vortexes of scourge energy. I would steer clear if I were you, Pathfinder. We haven't seen what it actually does to an, uh, a sapient being. I wonder if there's a broken Atmo processor somewhere that's causing this downpour. Stop fussing. A little rain won't kill you. <laughs> they can't have really made themselves at home here. How come they don't know how it works? I kind of think the Archon's just like gonna let me go through here and activate it so that, and then he can have it. Look sort of. at all of these plants. Oh yeah. Hostile shuttle incoming. Born to love this, I saw that. Hey, uranium. Plants that thrive on uranium. Oh wow, this reminds me of um, not Ilios. Yeah, Ilios. In Mass Effect 1. Not like a bad thing, not like a lot, just a little bit. Like how long wow. it is. It's all completely overgrown. a lot of space. Uranium. Very convoluted. This place is a labyrinth. You sure we haven't been this way before? Don't, don't, don't. It's very unique. 
Focus on one group, then we'll get the other. Is there a different group around here? Lot of cat equipment. Looks like they set up camp. Turret controls. Oh. Remains. Nothing. You can reload. That would be good. Is it like part of the wall that fell off? I can't believe we're at Meridian. Yo. Heavy artillery! Watch out! Where? I detect working remnant technology. We could turn that against them. Where? You guys take care of it. Oh crap, I'm about to jump in the ooze. I think that's the last of them, for now. Come on, come on, come on, how long, how many doors do I have to open? Whew. This shit just gets weirder and weirder. It's like Havarl here, it's sort of. It's very dark. Good, that atmosphere. All right. Might be goodies on that tower, but I don't care. Yeah. 
Don't be angry, don't be angry, don't be angry, don't be angry, don't be angry. What the hell? Translating. Pattern 1-3. Viability, 56.2%. What? Genetic template transmitted for testing. They were doing... things to the Ankara. Uh, so the, the remnant were? We can't be sure what this is yet, Joel. Really? Because the last time we saw something like this, the Ket were turning us into them. Sam, I need an analysis. It appears that these beings are not Angara. They are not even alive. What does that mean? I don't understand. They look so... The remnant language refers to these bodies as genetic templates. A blueprint, like the plants we saw. The Angara? We came from here? They created us? Why? I don't know. Doesn't matter why. Where you came from doesn't change who you are. True. And we still face the same conflicts. I just feel as though something has shifted. Well, yeah, man. I need to think. I need to speak with the Moshai. Meridian creates life. And the Archon could use it to do the opposite. Destroy everything. Glad I brought y'all. It's up to us to make sure that doesn't happen. If we crack Meridian's controls first, we make sure the Archon can't use it. Oh, wow. Okay. It, well, that's why it was dark in here. It was, it was hiding. Hey, Joe. Learning stuff about where you come from can really shake a person up. I'll be all right. It helps to know I have the support of friends like you. Yeah, I got your back. I got your back. That's adorable. I'm dying. That's adorable. that's just that's great. Some kind of plant prototype, you think? Oh. So maybe, I mean, Havara was the home world. Stars. There must be hundreds. Why are this many of them here? Don't like it. Feels wrong. Doesn't feel right, that's for sure. There's definitely weirdness going on here. Was this all an ex- Maybe, does- I mean, if the Dangnab Meridian can create not just plants and all that, but it can create life like like um like the angara then if it destroys them or is the are the angara like intrinsically tied to the system and what are maybe that's why the remnant works for some of them you know like they have like a connection to it somehow this would like destroy any mythos involving their creation. The Archon knows about the Angara. That's gone. Ah, like yeah. But that's like cloning stuff. So let me, are they? If they're all, they might all be individual. No way. That's the rebirth thing. That's the reincarnation Those thing. Here before, were they? Oh my gosh. That's somehow tied into the reincarnation. If you can transfer memories to a body. It's working. The entire city's coming back to life. Interesting. That pool was hiding a lab down there. This was what it was like before everything got messed up. 